we got to walk, you know, you got to look where you're going. Hi everyone, it's Trish here from Dish Kitty Studio. Welcome to my weekly dish video. This is number 64. Um, I am going to flip through my daily journal for you. I'm still using this same book with the um, like handmade paper. Uh, it's so weird. I'm, I'm still really struggling with it. I, I honestly will be really excited when I'm done with this book, which I believe is going to be a little while. But um, So I left off with this page. Um, this was my birthday party with my family, the cake my sister made. Um, this was just a pretty regular day. We had tacos for dinner, obviously. So I drew some tacos there. Uh, here we went to the gym after work and we have a new uh, sandwich restaurant near us called Olga's. So we went there for dinner after the gym to try it out. So I just cut um, a couple of pieces out of the um, takeout menu and stuck them in here and then I drew a little picture of my sandwich. It's kind of a, like a wrap place. See it says it's not a sandwich, it's an Olga because it's called I would like an Olga. Um, so I just drew a quick little watercolor wrap here and then stuck that stuff in. This day I believe uh, my birthday was this weekend, so I had spent my Friday evening working on my Bob Ross video for Sunday, which this particular week I painted a bunch of trees. So I kept one of the trees and I stuck it in my book. So this is just a little pink tree. I spent most of the evening uh, working on that video, so there's that. Uh, March 16th. This was the day before my birthday. My birthday is St. Patrick's Day, so it was on Sunday. Uh, my girlfriend BJ came into town from, <clears throat> excuse me, from quite far away. Um, she's about five hours away, so she came to visit. Um, I painted a little shamrock here, and then I just stuck in, um, this is from the place we had dinner. It's a burger place. I just kept the little takeout menu, and I stuck it in. Um, we went to a little brewery, and I got uh, a flight and they wrote down my beers on this little piece of receipt, so I stuck that in. Um, we did some karaoke. This was the DJ's uh, business card, so I just kept that stuff and I stuck it in. Uh, we had some green champagne, so there's that. And here's a picture of me and a couple of my girlfriends. We stopped at this little liquor store and there's this like weird copper statue of this like dude sitting on a bench, so we all sat with him and it turned out really cute, so I stuck that picture in. Um, okay, this is Sunday. This was my actual birthday, um, and it says black, because I was feeling like trash. All this green champagne and these beers and all this fun karaoke stuff, your girl is too old for it. So Sunday was uh, basically just a wasted day because I felt like crap. I was trying to hydrate. I barely ate. I just felt awful. It does not pay to consume copious amounts of alcohol, kids. Remember that. Um, this is just a regular day. I have put some airmail stickers here because I did go to the post office and drop off some mail. And we had, um, I think we had soup for dinner. Yeah, we did because I was starting to feel sick. Uh, my Actually, okay, no. My husband was sick this day. He stayed home from work. I made chicken noodle soup for dinner because he was sick. And then, of course, as these days go on, you'll see that I get sick also. Spoiler alert. Um, so he was still feeling crappy. He stayed home from work uh, that day on Monday. He just had a really bad cold. Um, the next day, he still stayed home. Um, he worked though, he worked from home, but he did still stay home. So uh, this is another video I did. It was my weekly dish video from a couple of weeks ago. Uh, I did the Take 5 Art Challenge and I just kind of recreated that little flower here in my book. And then this is my little piece of paper that has the five prompts on it. This is another one of my friend Debbie's um, great ideas to take the scraps from your, um, your art table and just staple them together and put your date on them. So I think that's so cute. So my husband was sick and I basically spent the evening working on my video here. So um, that's what I that's what I drew. 
Um, this is Wednesday, March 20th, and I actually went to Grand Rapids, which is about an hour away after work, and I met up with a friend of mine, and we went to see Weezer and the Pixies. So this is a couple of stickers I bought at the show, Pixie stickers, and then I stuck my ticket here, and then I actually uh, journaled about that evening here. So um, at the stadium, I... You know, I got I had to leave right after work to get there in time for the show, so I actually ate at the concert venue, and I got this thing to eat called a grub tub, and it is like it was amazing. It was the greatest idea ever. It's like a big plastic soda cup, and the lid of it is like I mean you can see my drawing here. The lid has like a bucket and a big hole for the straw to come through, and then it's got chicken tenders and french fries in it, so you can literally like eat it and hold it with one hand. So like it's perfect for a concert or you know, whatever kind of event you're at. Um, it's brilliant, so you can walk around and carry your food and your drink in one hand, it was amazing. So this was my grub tub, and then I just drew the Weezer logo here, and I just kind of like wrote my thoughts about the show and all that kind of stuff. And of course, drew my grub tub because I was just obsessed with that thing. Um, this day, uh, I drew this little picture of my husband sleeping. He was actually starting to feel better, but he was taking these like cold meds, like nighttime cold meds. And so this particular night, this day, he had woken me up the night before and he was talking in his sleep about work. And he, I remember him doing that maybe once, like years ago, talking, like he woke up in the middle of the night talking about video games or something. But this time he was talking about work stuff, and I'm pretty sure it was because of these cold meds, but it was still pretty funny. So I drew a little picture of him, and then I wrote a little quote about what he was talking about. So I was starting to feel, he was getting better, but I was starting to feel sick at this point. Um, oh. I skipped a page here. Okay, and here is where I started to really get sick. So I drew a box of Kleenex because it was my side kick that day. This was a Friday. My husband actually left on Friday to go out of town. Um, so I was home alone, and this was me on Saturday. I was home alone, and I spent the entire day. It was like, you know, the first day of the spring where it's like sunny and it's like tolerably like you can go outside with just maybe like a fleece jacket on and not like a heavy winter coat and it feels like pretty comfortable maybe like a hoodie or something you know and the sun was shining and it was gorgeous and I was so sick I had plans to go out and have breakfast with my mom and we were gonna go get our nails done and I did not do any of that I laid on the couch and I watched a bunch of Netflix and I took a bunch of naps and I tried to hydrate and drink hot tea and it was awful. I felt terrible. So Sunday, um, it says, I felt a bit better today. So I think I was like starting to be on the upswing. Saturday was definitely the worst of it. Um, I wasn't, I still wasn't great, but I was getting better. Um, I finally was able to get out. My mom got me this beautiful new set of pots and pans for my birthday. I stuck a little sticker from the packaging here and then I drew a picture. They're this gorgeous like blue color on the inside of the pans. They're really, really pretty. So I finally got those out and washed them and put them away and got rid of my old pots and pans that were all worn and beat up and everything. So I was pretty excited about that. Okay. See how these pages are so, they stick together so badly. Um, nothing much here. This was Monday. Um, I did some ink samples here because uh, I cleaned a bunch of my fountain pens and I re-inked them. So these were the new inks that I put in. So I just did that and then I drew a little fountain pen down here. That was really the most exciting thing that happened that day. Um, Tuesday, we went to the gym and on our way home, we stopped at our favorite sandwich place and got sandwiches. And we have not had sandwiches from this place in a really long time. Like it's probably been about, it's probably been a year. And I was so excited and I wolfed down my sandwich and I was like so hungry after working out at the gym and everything. I was like, oh my gosh, I could eat a whole other sandwich, which obviously I didn't and I probably would not have, but it was so good. I was very excited about that sandwich. Um, let's see, Wednesday, March 27th, I drew the YouTube 
logo. Oh, because I was working on my video. It's Wednesday, so I was doing my weekly dish video for last week. No, last week. Yeah, last week. Okay. Um, this day, let's see, Thursday. I'm trying to remember what happened. My husband and I went for a walk around our neighborhood, and then we went out to this new Korean place um, in town, and it was really, really good. We enjoyed it a lot. We had a good time. And then on our way back, we stopped and got a donut from my favorite donut place, so I stuck a piece of the bag in here, and then I drew a picture with the donut. Uh, we went for another walk. We went on this hiking trail that we really like, so I just sort of, I found this in the backyard. Um, that same day because after we walked the trail and did the hike we came home and we had to like clean up some of the brush that was in our yard and stuff like that. I found this really cool feather so I stuck it in this little baggie and stuck it on my page and then I just drew kind of like watercolored like some gray and blue sky up here and then I watercolored a little tree because we did our little nature hike. That's as far as I have gotten. That's Friday the 29th. Today is Wednesday, April 3rd. That's all I've got for now. This is some stuff that I plan to use, but I haven't gotten there yet. So I think that's it for this week. Um, one other thing I wanted to mention to you guys is that I am participating in the 100 day project. So um, it started yesterday, April 2nd. What I decided to do for 100 days is blog. So I am actually writing an entry on my blog every day for 100 days. And I did start that up yesterday. And I also did an introductory post on April 1st. So if you want to check out my blog, the link is in the description box below. And I will also tell you it's www.trishesworld.com. So if you want to see those posts or any of the other posts, I've had that blog for about 12 or 13 years or something like that. So there's plenty of content there if you're interested and you want to take a look, ranging from all sorts of topics. But if you want to follow along with my 100 day project, um, definitely go there and check it out. I will be posting a new blog every single day somehow. I'm going to have to figure out what I'm going to write about. I think I'm definitely going to be using some prompts for that one. Um, but I would encourage you to check it out. It should be fun. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it very much. Be sure to like this video. It helps a lot. And subscribe if you would like to see more. I will catch you uh, next week. I, I have another video coming out on Sunday, my Bob Ross video for this week. And I'll see you again with another weekly dish video next week. Have a great week and I'll see you soon.